After an apocalypse that no one really noticed, Earth is totally fracked. A sudden leap in technology after Anonymous Army's Infotech War victory means that anybody with a fair and willing to risk it can take a crappy bus into space. To a new planet, Glenn Green World. But it's here, the plug hole to Earth, Litchfield Bus Station, that our heroes struggle to sell burgers. This is weird. Are you sure you don't want any help? No. Beard. This is classic last minute regime encouraging maximum beard growth. Beard of the Year competition is a man competition for manly men. And tonight, I'm in it to win it. Ah, I can really feel it growing. Last year, Ron Van Mandervan. Ron Van Mandervan. Won it. And he ended up going out with Miss Glenn Greenwell. <laughs> Ladies, here I come. I better go get ready. What's so manly about working in a kitchen? It's not just a kitchen, Joey. It's in a van, which is the manliest place to have a kitchen. I serve meat. I sell man food to man men in an environment of extreme danger. Knives that can cut a man to death. Extreme heat that can burn a man to death. And there's freezers that can freeze a man's arms to death. I work in the kitchen too. Why can't I have a beard? Well, for one, you wear a hairnet. Yeah, it stops my hair getting all smelly. I'll rest my case. If I had a beard, it would change everything. You'll never know, you weird, pubeless boy child, but having a beard is like having an extra set of balls. <laughs> Give it here! Huh? <laughs> ah! That's mental, you've hurt yourself! Ah! Well, I've got a surprise for you, Uncle John. I'm coming to the Beard of the Year competition as well. What's that? Insta Hipster Beard Kit. Just bung it in the microwave, change the microwave setting for length and colour, and wallop, the beard will magically affix. It's my competition with Ron Van Mandervan and Miss All Green. right, all right. I'm sorry. Time for real men with real beards to go and get ready. Come on, Uncle John. You've been in there ages. You'll miss your competition. Good to go. I've had the three S's, two shits and a shave. No! No! Oh, no, John, no, you idiot! No! What have I done? Insta hipster beard. Yes! Where is it? Give it to you. No, it's mine. Give it to you. No, you said it was cheating. It's not. It's not because I can grow a beard. This was an accident. Hey, old man. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, hang on a minute. What? Joey! Joey! Joey, it's not grafting! What's wrong now? It's just not grafting! What would you mean it's not grafting? Oh! Oh! oh. 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 Hey, no, give it here! It's give it here! Get one come on! Let go! Come on! 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 Why? Why won't it come off? It says in the instructions they will take to the person with the most testosterone. Brackets manly. It's a safety feature to stop it from sticking to women and children. But I'm the most manly. Well, I thought that as well. But clearly the beard thinks it's me. That's, that's not right. That's not right. I've got testosterone bleeding out of my arse. That is not testosterone. The beard will change its mind. Come on, beard. Come on. Come on. Come on, beard. Come on, beard. Let it go! Okay? Wow! Seems like not having a beard all this time has held me back. Maybe finally I can become the explorer I've always dreamed of being! 
what would Ron Van Mandevan do? Ron Van Mandevan. you now to a piece of wood. My bus is about to leave. I've got my ticket, I've got my passport. I'm leaving. Cut the beard off, it's mine. I pay for it. It's too late, John. For the metrosexual man who doesn't mind matching his socks with his shirt. Metrosexual. Ron Van Mandevan's pink feather. Maybe the metrosexuals were right. Well, it's time. That's my bus, Uncle John. I'm leaving. What in the name of Edward Snowden are you thinking? I'm a metrosexual man now. I'm intentional about me hair. Hormones. Come on, Beard. Smell my perfume. <whistles> Go on. Are you levitating? What? Oh my God! What have I become? Oh, oh. Don't look at me. And all this to stop me leaving? Well, it's not going to work this time, Auntie John. No. Go. Go. Go on. Enjoy yourself. Have a great life. Look what you made me do. What I made you do? <laughs> my, my beard! Hey! Hey! You did this on purpose. No. You actually manned up and wished me the best for once. Did I? You did this on purpose. Hey, I could might still be able to make the beard competition. As what? Rum Van Manda Lady? Rum Van Manda. I don't think so. Well, I'm going to explore the universe bare chin. But Joey! Joey! Boma! Still your fault. I look nothing like my passport photo. Well, it wasn't a real beard. Only real men can handle two sets of balls, Joey. Whatever. You know, I've learned something from Ron Van Mandevan about his pink feather, about manliness and metrosexuality. Good night. All right. Um, if you like that, why not subscribe to the channel? Then that means we can make more, and maybe there'll be merchandise, like sponges or sausages. I mean, it won't be sausages. It's not even about sausages. It's about the future.